What's up, you guys? It's your girl, Isabella Tara Tarot, back here again, going to hit you with your weekly prediction. Thank you so much for all of the positive energy you guys send to the channel, all of the likes, the shares, the comments. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um, I am not currently accepting any more personals in this time, but you're more than welcome to go on over to my Etsy spiritual shop. All the information is listed in the description box below, along with my Patreon. There are three tiers on Patreon. If you choose to go over there, make sure... Um, that you pick the right one for you. If you pick the third tier, make sure to send me your name, your birthday, and the topic of choice, or if you want a general reading to the Patreon messenger, okay? Please don't mix any of the platforms because they get confusing, and I will, I'll end up looking over your message. Just don't do it, please. If you're interested in his, um tarot deck you i will have it listed in the description box along with my other listings anyways y'all so this week what you can know to expect what you can know to be aware of i keep dropping the card so what is this why does chris brown keep coming out <laughs> i keep seeing chris brown like the song was drop it low and i'm like i'm not going there with you guys okay but i keep dropping something okay so something may be dropped for you this week okay um, I feel like somebody realized that the grass wasn't greener on the other side, okay? I feel like there is somebody here who is having, being forced to grow up against their own will. Mm -hmm. This week, you may be dealing with somebody here who has constantly gone against the grain, constantly started shit with you, okay? I feel like you are, I heard shunning, so you may be shunning this person, all right, I feel like there's definitely this energy coming through where you may have got you a new boo thing, okay? I feel like you literally have moved on. Um, I feel like you're dropping something, okay? Um, for some of you, you might have thought that a partnership was going to resurface. I feel like you're dropping that idea this week. Or somebody is dropping the idea of getting back with you this week, okay? Um, I'm definitely getting this vibe coming through of um, there may be um, something about loose ends that need to be tied up. Tied up loose ends. Mm -hmm. Page of Wands. I feel like Page of Wands keeps coming out for every sign that I have done. There's a lot of communication going on in this time, okay? Um, and I feel like there's like big, I heard big things popping, little things stopping. So, I guess we're just going back to um, the early 2000s, all right? Um, I feel like there's definitely this energy going on this week where maybe nostalgia, you may be um, in communication with somebody from your past, okay? So, this is what we're going to say um, before everything keeps going. Anything that falls on the floor, I'm not picking it up. I'm not going to keep doing that. <laughs> uh, so, if they fall on the floor, they just fall on the floor. It's not meant for the reading. Um, I, and that's also the energy that I'm picking up on for you guys. Like, whatever is not meant for me, I'm letting it go. Okay? So, you're in the energy this week of letting something go. I feel like you may also be communicating this with somebody. We've got loss and love spell that tried to also come out. So, somebody may have... Um, participated in some kind of love spell or tried to get something to I heard love loss somebody here have been constantly trying to bring back an old flame okay or constantly been trying to get in touch with somebody from their past I feel like they're giving up in this time um I heard bygones be bygones I feel like somebody had been going like doing things when I'm getting love spells it doesn't feel like you know the love and light God bring in the attract let let, let what's meant for me be mine I don't feel like that's the type of love spell that this person was doing I feel like uh whether this is you or somebody else somebody's giving up Okay, there's somebody here who, I keep getting tombstone too, like, um, that was also the energy of the day, was like coffin. It gives me coffin spell. I feel like some of you may have tried to um, close out a situation with somebody. I feel like there's like a love gone wrong or a love gone bad. Um, I'm getting somebody, whether this is you or someone else, was very angry at the way that a situation played out. Um, the fact that the tomb is officially closed. Okay, for an emperor, I feel like we're talking to the masculine energy. I feel like some of you have gotten very clear about how you your feelings and what there is and what there isn't. The fact that I keep getting magician for y'all, I'm definitely getting that somebody was hardcore trying to bring in a love partnership that's been dead and gone for quite some time. Um, I feel like 
<laughs> somebody's growing up. Like I heard growing pains. I feel like this week may be um, a lot of growing pains. Like I feel like you may also have some kind of joint joint issue growing pains i feel like there's maturity happening this week um for a masculine individual i feel like there's somebody here who might have possibly been trying to paint some kind of illusion um i'm getting calling on the ancestors trying to get something uh, make something out of nothing okay but it feels like it's like i'm seeing a whole lot of casting of you know rituals i'm getting that there was literally somebody here who has constantly done the same thing i heard run the same running the same drill okay this may be somebody who likes to watch basketball i feel like this person has constantly done the same thing trying to call in the same thing um it's like they may have contacted someone who was you know on another level than them to try to help them get this to come in but i feel like somebody's finally giving up and going within i'm getting there is like a huge shift happening within someone who had sworn that they would never let this person go or would never let the situation go we've got virgo here we've got aries here i feel like this person may actually communicate with you in this time that they're over it or they're done okay i'm getting a bowing out energy i feel like somebody is tired of fighting this week i see this hose ain't loyal so i feel like <laughs> Somebody is realizing that their like the loyalty doesn't lie within this individual, whether this is you or someone else. I'm definitely seeing that this person is ready for their new beginning. For some of you, this person was casting love rituals onto you, hoping that to get you to come back to them or to allow them to come over to your house. I'm getting somebody wanting in your house, okay? Um, literally casting rituals. I feel like you might have been experiencing um, loved ones or deceased loved ones coming and telling you what's been going on behind the scenes. I'm getting a lot of spiritual activity this week, okay? I also get that there is possibly about to be a passing within this week, um, possibly of a family member. My condolences, okay? But I feel like a new chapter starts this week within your life. I feel like you're getting very, I feel like it's very freeing. Like I'm getting somebody being freed as well. I'm getting Buffalo Man and Buffalo Spirit. I'm also getting freed from a mental prison. Some of you may have wondered why you were constantly um, struggling with certain thoughts or um, a certain living situation. I feel like that's that's being cleared up this month. I feel, I say this month, damn, it's going to take all month. It may take a month, but I'm definitely getting this week. There's going to be communication about somebody bowing out. Um, I'm getting that there's somebody here having like massive headaches. Um... I'm getting headaches and joint pain, okay? I feel like there's something about a lost love spell. I feel like there's a backfiring of a love spell going on right now that's causing someone migraines and joint pain. Like, I feel like they're actually experiencing physical symptoms of, um, basically, the ancestors of this person is coming through, whether this is your ancestors coming through and stopping this or someone else's, if you cast this. I feel somebody's ancestors are coming through and stopping this shit and sending it back to this person. It's causing them to have massive, like, migraines, headaches, joint pain. Like, they're going through it on a physical level. I feel like it is a purging of this energy. It's being sent back. They're sending it back to this individual this week, okay? Um, this person is going through massive amounts of loss, okay? I feel like they, they're, they're just like, why is this not working? Why is this not working? Okay, this person did this. Why is this not working, all right? I feel like you are being freed. This week is the week of your freedom, I heard the first week of freedom in quite some time, all right? Um, something's very significant about seven, seven months. You may have been under this spiritual attack for seven months, seven years, okay? I feel like you're freeing yourself. Some of you are freeing yourself from some kind of, um, I'm, I keep getting cursed energy. Some of you have literally had a curse placed on you, okay, um, from rivals past, all right? It's like it was on your love life, trying to keep you from being able to achieve love or to um, accept love, okay? I feel like that is being changed. Like, it's all, it's, it's completely flipping in this time. And I told you, cough and spell. Um, there's been a, a rival, behind-the-scenes rival, quite some time. Like, it feels like somebody who won't take no for an answer, 
Okay, um, I'm getting that this something is being it's it's being forced on this person to grow up this week. Somebody's being forced to grow up this week. Okay, I'm getting that there is someone here who is constantly in this mischief energy that can no longer. It's something about it's not going to stand anymore. There's something about this mischief is no longer going to stand. I feel like they have also made a lot of enemies along the way. I feel like there are some somebody here who has, you know, made enemies that are also wanting to partner with you in this time. All right. Um, I'm getting that <sighs> this person is under judgment. Not only are they under judgment, they're like literally going through physical battles on all ends. Okay. Um, I'm getting having to lay in the bed that they've made. For some of you, this could definitely be an Aries, but I feel like this person, um, they're realizing that they've taken on too much in this time, and I feel like you may actually be getting some communication about this person literally trying to um, move away from a certain situation, or they want to try to um, come through and let you know that they actually want to work on things with you. I feel like somebody here who's constantly been trying to make your life hard is bowing out, and I feel like they want to make um, amends, or at least... Um, get on the same page with you. I'm definitely getting that in this time. Somebody here who's been incredibly hard to work with is coming through trying to have a conversation with an emperor, like saying like they're done, okay? Um, they're they're understanding that something's really over, all right? And they want to, to be able to work with you the best way possible, okay? I feel like this person here has, they have been trying to illuminate things. I'm so glad the sun came out and said the moon because we keep seeing the moon. I feel like something's been illuminated about this person, their true face, their true colors, all right? Um, the fact that they aren't capable of staying in a certain partnership or relationship. I really feel like this person, um, they're wanting to, the new opportunity. Somebody's wanting a new opportunity. I feel like they have been, had some kind of new opportunity come their way, okay? To where they're like, okay, it's time to move it's time to go okay for some of you you are going to be getting a new opportunity this week for some of you it's literally with this person um to work on something it doesn't necessarily feel like a love partnership it just feels like everybody understands what is going on in this time that there's nothing salvageable about a certain situation and you have to work with what's left okay that's really what i'm getting i feel like a huge revelation and like epiphany is happening this week um to where everybody really understands um what like the truth of a situation what's actually left after the you know storm has come through after the like what's left of the rubble what we're going to do with what's left is what i'm getting for some of you this is literally a separation like a divorce is what i'm seeing um some of you are going to be having talks about finalizing this or making something very like something that was really apparent that but was fueled by a lot of emotions like i feel like people are moving away from the rubble moving away from the emotional aspects of a situation like done it, it's done <laughs> okay yes we see it's done it's over i feel like there may also be some kind of communication about a home um no longer being there okay i feel like somebody's literally trying to relocate in this time um and they plan to be fully relocated by september all right um, I feel like there's going to be some kind of conversation that's had about this because someone wants to make sure that fin like finances are handled. Um, anything that may have been owed is handled before this move is made. All right. What else can you expect this week? What does the earth signs need to know this week? <laughs> Look, adult conversations going from petty to an adult conversation okay and it, but it's because there's some kind of finances for some of you you may share a child with this individual or some kind of property all right there's going to be some kind of news coming in about that some kind of debt may also be um closed on in this time okay you may be getting some kind of news about this i feel like there's someone here who may also try to lie to you about some kind of finances try to make something seem like it's not as big as it is just be aware of what you're signing in this time if you are having to sign something but i do get that somebody is completely over a, a relationship okay for some of you i feel like it's very freeing i feel like you are feeling very freed uh this week like i, I keep getting freedom 
freedom and finances. So a lot of you are going to be very happy about this. For some of you, you had wanted to move on to another love partnership. I feel like you also had someone waiting on you, okay, to be able to get to this place. I feel like you are coming into a time of celebration. I feel like you also will be getting some kind of news um, about some kind of party. I feel like you may have friends reaching out to you trying to get you to collaborate with them or not necessarily just collaborate. Like I'm getting like coming over or going out with these people, meeting up with groups of people um, in celebration. I feel like you're definitely going to have something to celebrate this week. It's like something that has been a long time coming. I feel like there is some kind of opportunity on like out here for you this week. For some of you, I'm getting... Um, it's just a closure. Like, I feel like some of you are going to be cele celebrating some kind of closure, okay? For some of you, this could literally be a home situation where you're closing on a home. I feel like it's been a long, hard journey, especially if it was in regards to anything dealing with a house. Um, I feel like there, you might have been wondering if this, if things were ever going to change, if your ships were ever going to come in. You're finally seeing them this week, okay? You're finally realizing that the hard part of a situation is, oh, and you're ready to celebrate okay i'm also seeing with that buffalo spirit like nothing is ever wasted okay um i feel like you may have had to endure a lot of heartache a lot of pain um strife like a lot of emotional um conversation i feel like you had to sort out a lot of things it's like having a lot of things thrown at you all at once while you're trying to um get something in line okay i feel like all of that's over i feel like this is, it was all the purpose of this was for you to um be truly grateful for what was about to come your way i'm getting bibbity bobbity boot it's almost like she does this has this conversation makes this incredibly clear and then boom there goes your dream home. Um, i'm getting a barbie dream house for some of you i feel like you have um possibly been i'm getting a bidding war i'm seeing a bidding war you might have been in a bidding war okay um you're going to be getting news that your um rival whoever this was who was rivaling you is bowing out i feel like you're the reason you're going to be celebrating is because you get this new opportunity you get this home you get this house um there's something about it there's a financial aspect to the message that you get this week that you're going to be incredibly happy about okay i feel like it was a long time coming it was very uh, a lot of strife a lot of back and forth i feel like some of you um it's like you had to fight the devil. Like when I say fight the devil, I feel like you had to hold on to like and able to you had to be able to hold on to your finances. I feel like for some of you, that was really hard. For some of you, you really wanted to like just I'm getting something about um you spend you emotionally spend okay when you start feeling some type of way you just start throwing fucking money. That's your toxic trade. Okay, I feel like you've got that under control. Okay, and it was hard. It was hard. It was hard. But the high priestess, you listened to yourself. You leveled up on a hoe. Okay, um, and I'm not necessarily saying the person that you were um, battling with for this home situation, this 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 person was a hoe but i feel like you are like finally the contract that i need is here i feel like there was somebody who was also um it's almost like I'm, the way that i'm seeing this bidding war is like one up one up somebody was trying to one up you i'm getting that you get the upper hand this week okay not only do you get the upper hand even if this isn't a bidding war that's just what they were showing me if this is like literally um some form of deal that hadn't been struck that you were dealing with a shady ass individual i feel like you're you're striking the deal you're making things incredibly clear um i feel like somebody's bowing out okay this week and i feel like you're going to be feeling like you're in a seat of power okay for some of you you're moving to the head of the household this week okay um i feel like you are very solid very stable and it's like you don't just have one buffalo you have two okay like i'm getting something about you may also be getting someone else's buffalo <laughs> what the hell someone else's buffalo something that was owed them they have to pay up to you because they owe you in some type of way all right i'm also getting somebody here who was bidding this bid war that they keep showing me it's like this person here who was bidding against you um you might have thought that you had lost something because they overbid what you were trying to pay 
uh, they had solidified a contract or thought they did, and then they didn't have the closing money. That's what I'm getting. I feel like somebody didn't have the money to close on this house, and then you close on it because you were very, you knew what was going to be asked of you, okay? Um, so you made sure that you had what you needed, okay? I feel like this person outbid you, but they didn't have the closing cost is what I'm getting. So there's something about something that had to be paid. This is why Spirit's been telling you to sit still. Don't act crazy don't be spending don't be blowing shit on amazon prime don't don't keep going to target and walmart just acting crazy over here oh it's a good deal no um i feel like you've gotten very smart and because you did this you are about to be rewarded your barbie dream house boo anyways that is what i'm seeing for you guys this week congratulations on those of you who are actually closing on a house and for those of you who remained patient okay you got the mind touch this week Anyways, love you guys so much, and I'll see you later. Don't forget to like the video. Bye.